December the 5th. And Josh called me, nephew, said he shot a little buck down here. We're fixing to go check him out, see what he's got. <laughs> Hey, see that? Scrape right there. You didn't even see it, did you? <clears throat> he said he done located him, said he done checked him, he's dead, so we ease up here and see what he's Oh yeah. Let me pick his head up. Let's check him out. There's nothing wrong with that. He's got it two on one side and four on the other. Well, you messed that shoulder up, didn't you? I don't see how you run. His back legs are working. He's dragging his thing in. He's bulldozing everything. He's bulldozing. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. He actually. Did he get anything? Looks like he's three and a half, actually. He might would have been a seven next year, but he wouldn't have got a lot better. Ain't nothing wrong with that, though. Actually, he had one here. It broke off. He should have been a seven point. I think that's the biggest thing he ever saw. I think Danielle had this deer at 15 yards with her bow, but she couldn't. She done used both her buck tags. She didn't have nothing but doe tags. So we'll get him loaded up and get him out of here. Oh, that's just a. This is what you hang out with the young guns for so they can do all the work. <laughs> I guess I can help him. Well, nothing like one of these big old rascals to mess up a deer hunt. But uh, I'm going to tell you, when you think you're messing up a deer hunt, I shot this hog, drug him off the lane, and saw five deer on that lane. After I drug him off, deer come in within 20 yards of where this hog was laying, and they never paid him any attention. So just remember when you when you shoot a hog like this, this is a big old boar too. He stinks. When you shoot a hog like this, those deer... Uh, don't think it messed up your hunt. Just just keep hunting. Leave him lay till you get done hunting. Sometimes you'll see a deer after that. We've proven they'll walk right by these hogs once they're dead. We got this young buck just come in. Let's see. 
pretty big, big body deer. It's got some nice little spikes. Got a fork on one side. Looks like a little three point. Just a year and a half old. Pretty deer though. I think it might be the big six. He's an eight. Oh yeah. You ready? Oh my gosh. That's John. I'll take that one. You? <laughs> You let me forget this one. <laughs> That's nice. He's a pretty good buck. Nothing like turning your camera on, having a buck in it, and leaving it on standby and not hitting the record button. I hit it and it didn't start recording, so the only recording we have of that is a Tacticam. Oh, Send Josh a text. Well... I done killed one buck uh, the third day of Arkansas's rifle season. We're in the second weekend of the rifle season and hunted hard all week. Uh, had to work one day and seen quite a few bucks. Was waiting on another good shooter. Danielle's killed both her Arkansas bucks. And uh, we just made it happen again. I was trying to get everything on film and I got my eyeballs back here behind me. She's got the binoculars. She's been watching everything and uh i told her i said i'm getting this one on film whatever i do so i flipped the camera on and hit record and i don't know if i just hit it too fast or bumped it or what but it did not start recording uh the good news is i did get it on tacticam and uh should have that footage through the tacticam hopefully all that pans out but we got a pretty nice buck on the ground, so we fist and go check him out. Ain't that right, girl? Yeah. Let's go. All right. Let's go get it. Keeping it real, huh? Keeping it real. Meat in the freezer. I'm gonna take a picture right there. This thing starts try to take over God. We try to take him out. He's done pretty good to take it. 